Is it time to buy or sell Microsoft stock? In this video, we're diving deep into Microsoft. Our initial report was published on our website on Wednesday, 22nd May, 2024, and now we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. You don't want to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Enhance your trading decisions by trying our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of AI and get a free price predictions and deep analysis for anyone among 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. Since the 14th of May, 2024, our system has ranked Microsoft as a buy candidate, giving it a score of 4.76. Let's take a look at the stock's performance during this period. The stock has seen a gain of 3.35%. This translates to an average return of 0.48% per day since it was listed as a buy candidate. The stock has broken the wide and horizontal trend up. Breaks like this are often followed by swift and strong movements, and any correction down to the break line at approximately $429.63 is considered to be a second chance to hit a potential runner. It is, however, important that volume does follow the price as false breaks may appear and it may move back into the horizontal trend. Based on the rectangle formation theory, the stock is predicted to reach $469.83 sometime during the next three months. The current three-month trend suggests a potential 0.0866% change over the next three months with a possible return between negative 9.47% and negative 0.121%. As for the 12-month trend, it suggests a 33.84% change over the next 12 months, with a potential return between 20.71% and 42.47%. This translates to a price range of $519.70 to $613 and 34 cents after a year. Our latest daily update for Microsoft includes the headline, Green Day on Wednesday for Microsoft Stock After Gaining 0.345%. The Microsoft stock price gained 0.345% on the last trading day, Wednesday, 22 May 2024 rising from $429.04 to $430.52. It has now gained three days in a row. It will be exciting to see whether it manages to continue gaining or take a minor break for the next few days. During the last trading day, the stock fluctuated 1.24% from a day low at $427.13 to a day high of $432.41. The price has risen in seven of the last 10 days and is up by 4.87% over the past two weeks. Volume fell on the last day by negative 3 million shares, and in total, 18 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $7,600,000,000. You should take into consideration that falling volume on higher prices causes divergence and may be an early warning about possible changes over the next couple of days. Over the past 52 weeks, the highest price of the stock was $432.97, and the lowest price was $309.45. Currently, the price is 0.57%, or $2.45, below the 52-week high of $432.97, which is also the all-time high for the stock. Analyst Ratings On Wednesday, May 22, 2024, it was reported that Mizuho Securities gave Microsoft a buy grade with a hold action. On Wednesday, May 22, 2024, it was reported that Goldman Sachs gave Microsoft a buy grade with a hold action. On Wednesday, May 22, 2024, it was reported that Wells Fargo gave Microsoft an overweight grade with a hold action. 
On Friday, May 17, 2024, it was reported that Macquarie gave Microsoft to outperform grade with a hold action. On Friday, May 17, 2024, it was reported that RBC Capital gave Microsoft to outperform grade with a hold action. Analysts have given Microsoft stock a general strong buy rating. They rate the P-E ratio as strong buy and price to book as strong buy. For return on investment, the analysts give the stock a strong buy rating. The following signals have been identified for Microsoft, mostly positive signals in the chart today. The Microsoft stock holds buy signals from both short and long-term moving averages, giving a positive forecast for the stock. Also, there is a general buy signal from the relation between the two signals, where the short-term average is above the long-term average. On corrections down, there will be some support from the lines at $423.68 and $413.28. A breakdown below any of these levels will issue sell signals. A buy signal was issued from a pivot bottom point on Tuesday, April 30, 2024, and so far it has risen 10.58%. Further rise is indicated until a new top pivot has been found. Furthermore, there is a buy signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MATD. Volume fell during the last trading day despite gaining prices. This causes a divergence between volume and price, and it may be an early warning. The stock should be watched closely. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence, buy signal, pivots, buy signal 17 days ago. Bollinger, buy signal two days ago. Short-term moving average, buy signal 15 days ago. Long-term moving average, buy signal 10 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages, buy signal eight days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart, we see short moving average, buy signal 14 days ago. The long-term moving average, buy signal 15 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages, buy signal 140 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk, and Stop Loss for Microsoft Microsoft finds support from accumulated volume at $416.42, and this level may hold a buying opportunity as an upwards reaction can be expected when the support is being tested. This stock is usually traded at a good volume, and with minor daily changes, the risk is considered to be low. During the last day, the stock moved $5.28, 1.24% between high and low. For the last week, the stock has had daily average volatility of 1.43%. Before we dive into the possible good trading levels for Microsoft, let's quickly cover some essential fundamental data. First, the price to earnings ratio, or PE ratio. This crucial ratio measures a company's current share price relative to its per share earnings. This is a relatively normal PE ratio, often seen in businesses with long track records or predictable revenues. In other news, the next earnings report for Q2 2024 is expected on July 23, 2024. Analysts' consensus estimates are at $2.90. Keep an eye on these numbers as they can greatly impact stock prices. Now let's discuss some potential day trading levels for Microsoft. There's no significant resistance from accumulated volume above, which means the stock could move upward swiftly under the right conditions. In this case, you might want to enter a position and use volume to determine when to exit. On the downside, Microsoft encounters its first support level at $416.42. If this support level holds, it could be a good entry point, anticipating a rebound. The combined average rating for Microsoft from multiple analyst sources is strong buy. Let's take a look at some recent insider trades. On April 15, 2024, Jala Alice L conducted an insider sell of 177,469 shares of common stock. On March 14, 2024, Rodriguez Carlos A. conducted an insider buy of 514 shares of restricted stock units. 
On March 14, 2024, Pricker Penny S conducted an insider buy of 21,261 shares of restricted stock units. On March 14, 2024, Peterson Sandra E conducted an insider buy of 41,396 shares of restricted stock units. On March 14, 2024, Magregor Catherine conducted an insider buy of 399 shares of restricted stock units. Based on the 100 most recent insider trades, we've calculated the insider power to be negative with a ratio of negative 34.501. Overall, insiders purchased 104,753 shares and sold 187,783 shares in the last 100 trades. Our recommended stop loss is set at $418.29, negative 2.84%. This stock has low daily movements, resulting in low risk. The RSI 14 is 83 significantly increasing the risk. A buy signal is present from a pivot bottom identified 43 days ago. Is Microsoft stock a good buy? Several short-term signals are positive and the stock has broken the horizontal trend up, which indicates an even stronger rate of rising. We conclude that the current level may hold a buying opportunity as there is a fair chance for Microsoft stock to perform well in the short-term period. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day, our systems find that the current price is overvalued. For trading on Thursday, May 23rd, we expect Microsoft to open down negative $0.5 and start trading at $430.02. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information, you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Comment below and share your thoughts. What is your target for the stock? Remember to like and subscribe. We wish you successful trading and have a beautiful day with regards from all of us here at Stock Invest.